Some students in the Santa Barbara Unified School District were back in the classroom today for the first time this school year. The district is slowly reopening for in-person learning. News Channel 3 Scott Sheehan takes us to Monroe Elementary School for drop-off and the start of class. Any idea how we were at 119? Let's, let's let our friends at home see too. Monday was the 119th day of the 2020-21 school year for Santa Barbara Unified School District, but the first in person. I'm happy to have him back in school. He needed to be back in school. He was struggling a lot at home and Zoom. Transitional kindergarten, kindergarten, and first graders started first. Classes were split in half, rotating two days in class with two days at home on Zoom. Zoomy friends, you guys need to log on to music. On the fifth day, everyone will be home on Zoom. Getting through this week and figuring things out and making changes as needed, and it just keeps gonna, gonna keep getting better and better, to be honest, I know it is. Later this week, second through sixth graders will be able to return to the classroom also, more than 100 educators will get their first dose of the COVID vaccine. Staff who are servicing medically fragile students who don't have that social distancing um, ability. So those are the staff that are going to go first. Some parents are concerned their kids are back in school, but feel the risk is worth the reward. I'm hoping to hear about all the new friends he made. <laughs> Finally, I'm glad to have him back. It's just I, you know, I hope that everything's in place and that they stay safe. Superintendent Hilda Maldonado encourages parents to keep a close eye on their child's health and keep kids home if they're feeling sick. In Santa Barbara, Scott Sheehan, News Channel 3. Oh, it's great to see.